His mother forces him to abandon his fiancée for a village girl. But little did she know that she was digging her son's grave. Now he is in a dilemma as to what decisions to make. Lena Screen Production presents this heart touching movie, Lost Companions, one a story for parents who insist their sons must marry a wife from the village at all costs. Lost Companions, one. <laughs> I, I really have to go. Ramsey Noah, Susan Patrick, Pascaline Edwards, Justin Buffon, also starring Omar Sheriff Captain, Monica Kwak Kumpon, Emmanuel Palmer, Abby Okain, produced by Abdul Salam, directed by Victor Magara, Mr. Meticulous, marketed by Dean of Team Production, Oprah Square, Kragana, and Adun Kumasi, Last Confidence One, a village girls really the best. Find out. Get your copy now. Son of a woman will see you. Greed is a disease. Ambition is an obsession. Stupendous wealth could make a man go haywire. When a wealthy man decides to use the blood of the innocent to become more prosperous, he will kill and kill and kill till he can kill no more. Danger looms. Anger rises. Suspicions become rife. And what dreams may come of this nation? Venus Film Production presents Dark Oji, Omar Sheriff Captain, Hassan Bafo, Imano Ama, Joe Modo, and Randy Clotter in an explosive and engaging thriller, Hour Before Midnight 1. Produced by Axelan Momoni and directed by Ifai Onyabo, Hour Before Midnight 1. Marketed in Nigeria by MX International, 9 Eden Pajole Nidumoto Lagos, and 51 Iwekaro Donija. Also marketed in Ghana by Venus Film Production, Opera Square Accra Ghana, and Adon Kumasi. Hour before midnight, one hold your breath. What will you do when you are forced to marry a girl from the village? What will you do when you find out that you are not the father of your baby? The stage is set for trouble. Venus Film Production presents this heart touching movie, Lost Confidence 2. Rousey Noah will find the truth at all costs. My brother. Susan Patrick is in love with two brothers. Pascaline Edwards is a double dealer. Soon before will not forgive her rival. Also starring Omar Sheriff Captain, Monica Kwa Kumpo, Lost Confidence 2. Produced by Abdul Salam, directed by Victor Amagara, Mr. Matika, and led by Venus Film Production, Opera Square, Kragana, and Abdul Kumasi, Lost Confidence 2. Get your copy now. Sure she's coming. She just said she's coming. Let's just wait a little bit. Just I might take it easy. Oh. I know when you're doing like this, you're hungry. You want to rush home and go and eat. Yes, yes, she can. I'm sorry. I'm sorry Hi. for keeping you. I, I, I can't really see you off now. My father is at home. Mike, I'm, I'm coming. I, are, are you sure we'll be able to see later? Um. Uh, it depends because I have a lot of work to do at home now. If I finish on time, I will come. But if I don't, I'll see you tomorrow. Please. 
Sure. I know what you want to say. Are you sure you really do? Oh, I love you so much. I love you more than you do love me. Actually, that's not true. I love you more than you can even imagine. <sighs> See, I know I love you. I know it's in my heart that I love you so much. I'll see you tomorrow. Oh, please, don't start now, please. I'll see you tomorrow. Mike! Bye-bye. I'm sorry for keeping you waiting, please. Uh, my father sent me on an errand. It's alright. So I was expecting you yesterday. Oh, <laughs> I I told you that my coming wasn't was, uh, wasn't certain, and you know it. So I couldn't make it yesterday because I was busy. Is this a time that school children come back home from school? Papa, I'm sorry. I have to stop over to give a friend a book. And that warrants you to come home at this time of the day? Sorry, Papa. The distance is very far, so I had to walk. <laughs> and that's why I'm coming back now, sir. I've been telling you. I've been telling you. Should anything happen to you, the regret is yours. Huh? Look, listen. A fly which doesn't listen to advice when they are burning dead body, it goes in there with it. A word to the wise is enough. Go. Thank you, Papa. I came to see Adjua, sir. Adjua? Adjua? Yes, what for? I, I, I'm from the teacher, sir. I, I brought her books. Teacher? Yes, sir. When did my house become a classroom? Tell me. It's just a message. Just, just a message? message. Yes, sir. Now, go and tell whoever might have sent you that you didn't see her. Eh? Eh? You people should leave my daughter alone. Look, I'll kill somebody. I'm sorry. I'll destroy somebody's life. Oh. I'm talking. Eh? What's all this? When did my house become a classroom? Next moment, teacher sent you this and that and that. Why is that stupid girl? Adwa! 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 Look, I am warning you. I am warning you. I don't want to see boys coming to look for you in this house again. Do you hear? Yes, Papa. You hear? Yes, Papa. Huh? Um, Papa, who, who was that? Are you asking me who was that? Are you asking me? Papa, I'm only asking because it's only my school boys that can come and... Shut up! Yes, Papa. Who is the boy your father has been complaining about? 
that he did not want me to rest. Mama, he's my classmate. He has no evil intention. Mm -hmm. At first, they don't have any evil intention. But watch out, my dear daughter. Boys are dangerous. Mama, see, I have friends too. And I visit them. Their parents have never treated me the way Papa treated for me today. Mama, it's not fair. Those friends you visit have other brothers and sisters. You are only child and we want the best for you. Adwa, please don't ridicule us. Eh? Your future matters a lot to us. Okay? Listen to me, Adwa. I want you to study hard. Eh? You gain admission to the university. Eh? You come out flying colors. Then you, you have a good job. You buy yourself a car. Live in a mansion. Then you take care of me and Papa. Eh? Yes, Mama. I want you to plan your life, okay? Yes, Mama. You want to be like me? Eh? Eh? Eh, Mama, I understand. You see? Change. You keep it. You can keep keep the change. Thank you very much. Price we have to pay for falling in love is the consequences of falling in love. So I'm okay. Okay. Let's see. Mm -hmm. I hope you like it. Yes, thank you.
sure you love me? Are you sure you love me? Are you sure? Yes. Are you sure you love me? Yes, I love you. Then if you love me, if you love me, right? Yes. I'm afraid, I'm scared. But if you love me, if you love me, just trust me. Um, She's my schoolmate. Her. She came to visit me, so I'm seeing how. See? Is that what this bar has been doing when I'm away? You will come and see me. It's a new phenomenon, eh? When did this start? Is that what you do when I'm away? Uh, Papa, I just said she's, she's my classmate and she came to visit me, so I... Where is your mother? She's gone out, sir. Oh, you think I have not heard of your illicit love affairs with her? You think my ears are blocked? I am warning you for the last time. If you like, Take my advice. If you like, ignore me. Kwame, be ready to face the consequences of any act of indiscipline you put up. I promise you that. I promise you. There are two types of reproduction, like I was telling you last week. Who can give me one? I told you, remember, we had two types. Um, you there. Asexual reproduction. Asexual reproduction. And that has to do with? Plants. Plants. Good. Who knows the second one? Who can give me the second one? OK, you there. Sexual reproduction. Sexual reproduction. And that has to do with? Man. Good. Sexual reproduction has to do with man. And that is what we all want to talk about this morning. We want to find out how babies are formed. We are all human beings and we come out from our mommy's womb. How do we come out from our mommy's womb? Was it through magic or a miracle? Look, science has proven that before a woman can become pregnant, she needs to have intercourse with a man. She needs to meet with a man. When a man meets a woman, the spermatozoa of this man gets into the vagina of the woman. This spermatozoa then mixes with the ovary, which in turn goes into the womb of the woman, and what makes a baby be formed. In any stages of pregnancy, there are symptoms that a woman undergoes. Some of these symptoms, as she feels weak, she always feels tired. 
she always wants to sleep. And most of all, she always feels nauseous. When I talk of nauseousness, I'm talking of the woman always trying to throw her. Anything you eat, and she happens to be close to you, she just wants to throw her. When it happens, who is that? Ajua. 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 Are you sleeping? No, sir. I'm not feeling fine. What is wrong? Headache? No, sir. I'm feeling weak, dizzy, and nauseous. Are you pregnant? God forbid I'm not pregnant. <laughs> Quiet, class. Quiet. She's not pregnant. Anyway, class prefect. Send her to the clinic after this lesson, okay? Yes, sir. And you as well. Stop sleeping. Yes, sir. Can we continue now? Yes. yes. Now you're talking about. How could you? You disgraced yourself today in school. What happened? How could you be sleeping in class while lectures were going on? Only for you to wake up and say, tell your teacher that you're feeling weak, tired, and nauseous. Do you know what that means? That is exactly the way I'm feeling. Even now, I feel like throwing up. Oh, mm. Ajua. Mm. I'm sure you're okay. Did you go to the clinic? Yes, I went for a test. They said the result will be out by Monday. Then whatever it is will be treated. Uh, they only gave me some painkillers and some bitter tablets. You'll be okay. You just be strong till Monday, okay? Okay. You'll be okay. And Jero, mm. I love you. I love you too. Okay. Sorry, sorry, eh? Come on. Gentle, gentle. Can you walk? Fine. Sorry, eh? Let me take it to the chemist. Oh. You sure you didn't eat anything? Sorry, eh? Sorry, oh. You want to vomit again? Sorry. I'm taking it to the chemist. You'll be alright, eh? The school authority has decided to expel your daughter to serve as a deterrent to other students. During PTA meetings, we discuss a whole lot of issues like how best you can bring up your children. Have you asked her who impregnated her? Madam, I've tried all that I could. You know, she's so stubborn and arrogant, she wouldn't tell me who impregnated her. I almost killed her, you know, but still, she wouldn't tell me who is responsible for that pregnancy. And you're looking at me, looking at me like a fool. Why don't you tell your head mistress who is pregnant? Calm down, calm down. Take it easy. Look who is talking. Calm down indeed. You allow this girl to roam about aimlessly. You don't even perform your duties as a mother. Mr. Mesa. The upbringing of a child is not the responsibility of only the mother. You as a father has a vital role to play as well. Like counseling her on boy and girl issues. Have you sat her down to discuss? Discuss what? Sex, of course. Sex? Yes. Sitting my daughter down to discuss sex? That is unthinkable of. Excuse me, madam. You see? These are the problems you parents shy away from. If you had sat her down to discuss all these kind of issues, this problem wouldn't have arisen. Parents, please learn to educate your children on sex matters so they don't find themselves in these kind of situations. Now look at you. Two miserable souls. I said it. Mr. Mendes. Like mother, like daughter. This 
since we're standing here, it's my only daughter. No, not my only daughter. My only child. Madam, thank you. Do something. Madam, there is nothing I can do. I did not take the decision all alone. Please help me sign this. Please, we can hide the pregnancy for a while. How on earth do you expect me to allow her in the school, the pregnancy? Please sign this, please. Thank you. See what you cost. See the harm you cost the family. You know the character of your father. How are we going to face him at home? Let's go. Have a blessed day, madam. from school late, and when I ask you, you tell me all sorts of stories. Boys come in and out of this house, and when you ask them, they tell me, teachers send books to be given to Adwa. You turn my house into a school. Look, if I find out that a teacher is responsible for this pregnancy, I swear, they will announce it obituary. Huh? Oh, sister, thanks. Oh, Adwa, look at me. Who did this tell me to you? Tell us so that we can find a solution to this now, okay? Hey, 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 I hope you're not thinking of terminating that pregnancy. It's against my faith. As for that bastard, you will carry that bastard till you deliver that bastard. Look, I tell you, her life is totally ruined. She has been expelled from school. And you are responsible. Like mother, like daughter. And whatever that happens to her, you will carry it on. Whatever that happens to her, you carry it on her. Papa, why do you, this is not the time to issue threats. This is the time to find a solution to help her. Why? Eh? You know she's our only child. Ajwa, Ajwa, look at me. I'm your mother. Who, for Christ's sake, tell me, who did this to you? Tell me. Don't get scared, okay? Can she talk? Can she talk? She can, talk. Can, can you talk? Please, can talk. She can talk. You can't even tell us who impregnated you because you sleep with all the men in this town. Eh? God forbid, I'm not sleeping with different men. It's only when I brought in that I slept with. What? You have slept with a man? Kwame me what You slept with Kwame me what You slept with Kwame me what Papa, please. Papa, please. Papa, please. Exercise patience. Please. You wait. You wait. I swear, we shall see. If Kwame Boatin is the one who slept with you, I'm telling you, he has beaten the tail of a sleeping tiger. A tiny push right like Kwame Boatin. We shall see. Okay. Hmm. We shall see. Okay. Okay. We can see what it's for, okay? We work out things for you. Ago! I go! Hey! 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 What does that never end? Oh, I hope there's nothing right there. Oh! Hey, but what is it? Hmm. Hmm. Let's go in hmm. and sit down. This is no sitting matter. I'm not sitting down. Oh, Adwa, you didn't go to school today. I go to school? How can Adwa go to school when that stupid rascal you call your son has totally ruined her life for me? Pami? Oh, oh what has he done? Mr. Vensa, you have known this family in this town. We have never raised an eyebrow against anybody. Uh, there's nothing that cannot be settled. Oh. You know, I see your daughter visits my son, you know, once a while. Visits your son? And you don't send her away? Oh, I, don't, oh, I, 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 I was not thinking they have any bad intentions. Those visits have rather caused something else. Th those visits have caused his life totally ruined. Oh, no, 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 no. What has he done? What's the problem? Tell her! Madam, Adwa said Kwame is responsible for the pregnancy. Now she's pregnant. Pregnant? She's no more going to school. Hey, yes, sir. Kwame, I will not chop. This boy will kill me. Hey! Mrs. Mensa, yes. You go away. Yes. When Kwame returns, I will talk to him personally. Yes, yes. And we are personally going to come to your house. We will come Please, there. please. please. Just... You better do. You better do. Adwa, Papa, Adwa, or else. Adwa, Papa, yes. Huh. Yes. Hmm. 
<coughs> you stupid girl, come on. Please, no, please. again. Oh, oh. You want to kill her? What? And you? Did you? That boy, that boy want to kill me. You have spoiled that boy. Oh, but exercise patience. Will eh? mm -hmm. you come and meet me here? You see what he has done? I'll talk to him. Talk to him where? This boy wants to drag my name into the man. He will come and see me face to face. Since he says he's mature enough to father a child, to impregnate a girl, the two of us can never live under one roof. The two of us can never live under one roof. And if the mother comes and she says, pay, she has to follow straight away. No sense. You say you are mature enough to father a child, to impregnate a girl, to put a girl in the family way. We can never live under one roof. I am telling you to leave this place. But what have I done wrong? Uh, what? Uh, you want to know what you have done wrong? You want to see my callous? Leave this place. Where do you want me to go to? Wait for me. You see what you have done. Wait for me. What's the problem? Oh boy, is that is that Joa's problem? Jeez. My father has thrown me out of the house. Oh, it's and honestly, I don't have anywhere to go to. So, Mike, can I stay with you? Sure. Sit down. Okay. Sit down, let me get you some Shall I take this to pull yourself in? Eh? That girl messed up. She messed up everything. She shouldn't have told anybody. Look at the trouble she's put me in. She's messed up everything. But you shouldn't blame her yet. I think we need to help her. How? What kind of help? When she's already blown everything open. How? Uh, the problem is how to find him. But there's a way out. There should be a way out. A way out? The school authority has expelled her from school. She's been expelled from school. No, what about you? They don't know I am pregnant at home. So, does that mean like she didn't mention your name to the school authorities? Yes. Well, besides, even if she did, it wouldn't make any difference. 
I've registered for my final year exams. I've registered for my university exams. I'll soon write exams and I'll be out of school. Oh boy. You know, the girl loves you. So? So you better go and look for her. Where? I have place, of course. God forbid me. Mike, you, you want my obituary to be announced by tomorrow, eh? I will never do it. I'm running away from this village. I'll run. Me, I, me I'm not staying. I'll run away from this village. Nobody's going to see me. As a final year student, you need to study hard so you can come out in flying colors. You know that's the only way by which you can enter the university. You can't run away from your, your responsibilities now. Remember, he who fights and runs away lives to run another day. And he keeps running and running and running and running and running. Okay, thank you. You're a true friend. Thank you. I have the plan. What plan is it? Can I talk to you for just a minute? Okay. You're very beautiful. Yeah. I, want, I want you to take me as your boyfriend. I'm sorry, I'm not interested. Please. I'm sorry, I'm not interested. Just look at what happened to our friend that Joy recently. She got herself pregnant by her boyfriend. I don't want to be a victim. I know, I know. We are not going to do the same thing. We will protect ourselves. Please. I want to finish with my education and then go to the university. I'm not interested. Yeah, I know that. Please. I love you. I'm sorry. Bye bye. What are you doing with that boy? He's worrying me. He says he wants me as his girlfriend. And what did you tell him? I told him I'm not interested. I hope not. So you saw what happened to Adra. You I want know. to be a victim. It's your own cup of tea. I, I hope not. Yeah, he's been worrying me. Okay, let's go. To me. I want you to finish your secondary education, gain admission to the university, get a better job, and be comfortable with yourself. Then after you look after me and Papa. Eh? So, I want you to terminate this pregnancy. I won't allow you to bring this child into this household. Do you know how old you are? Eh? Don't you know that your academic test will be finished? If you keep this pregnancy. Mama. I, I don't want to have an abortion. I hear that it kills people. Mama, I want to keep this pregnancy. Why do you want to kill your grandchild, Mama? Mama, see, I have a feeling that if I have an abortion, I will die. I can't, Mama, I can't. You think you know too much? I'm not going to tolerate any bastard in this house. If you still want to keep this pregnancy, not in my house! Huh? Oh! I'm here. I'm here. Uh, my father sent me out of the house. Mm -hmm. He said that I should come and stay with Kwame. Uh, you want to stay here? Are you out of your senses or do you want to get pregnant again? 
no, if you don't want me to hurt you, just get out of the premises. Please, sir. I don't have any place to go to. Please, sir, don't send me away. No, let me tell you, for your information, I have driven Kwame out of this house. And if I see him here, I am going to cut off his legs. You better leave this place. You people think you are grown-ups, so you do things that married couples do. Leave this place! Leave this place! Leave! 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 Move your body! Leave! Leave! Leave, leave this place before I throw you away! Leave this place! Leave. 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 forgive her. Let me bring her home, okay? So that we can do something to reform her life. Eh? This poor girl has been traumatized. This is the time she needs her love and support. If I don't bring her back, maybe she'll do something harmful to her life. Please. Andre Papa, please. If you step out of this house to bring that fool in here, I swear, you will follow her. Adra Papa, don't you think you are being too hard on this poor girl? Human beings make mistakes, you mistakes know. Mistakes indeed. <laughs> Dragging my name in the mud, and you are telling me it's a mistake? As far as I'm concerned, I don't have any child. Uh. Adra Papa, please forgive her. Please. What do you want in this house? What do you want in this house? Please, Papa, have pity on me. I know I have caused you so much shame and pains. Mama's father refused to work on me. He has also thrown Kwame out of the house. Papa, I don't have anywhere to go than to come back home. Please, Papa. Papa, please forgive me, please. Ajua. Papa. If you don't leave this house this very minute, huh? I swear I will kill you. Papa. Leave the house. Papa. If you don't leave this house this very minute, Adwa, I swear by the gods, I will kill you. So please go. Papa, you have the right to kill me. You brought me into this world and you can take me back. Papa, I, I know I have wronged you. I'm not worthy to be called your child. But Papa, please forgive me. Please, Papa. Mama, please forgive
say, my friend? Who are you? Come here, come here. Who are you? Come here. Who are you and uh, what do you want? I'm from the parish priest, sir. Um, he, he gave me a message to give to all the houses that the communion ordination is still coming on on Saturday. Oh. Parish priest? Yes, sir. Ordination? Yes, sir. Are you one of the mass boys? Yes, sir. Oh, all right. That's good enough. Uh, and uh, have you informed everybody in the neighborhood here? Yes, sir. Okay. Oh, that's good. Good boy. And uh, so, say hello to Father for me, all right? Yes, sir. All right. I said you should not call me. Kwame, I said you should not call my name. How could you, Kwame? How could you have done a thing like that? You tricked me to the hospital for me to have an abortion. Ajo, please, I, don't... I don't even believe you love me. You don't even love me at all. Ajo, that, that is not it. Please. You have to understand. Huh? Let's get rid of this baby. You, you want us to drop out of school? Let's get rid of this baby so that we can go back to school. I say I can't, Kwame. I don't mind the consequences, okay? Unless you want to deny me, okay? Ajo, I won't deny you, but come, let's, let's get rid of this pregnancy. You know, we need to be educated. And life will be very tough for us if we keep this baby without any good education. Please, let's get rid of this baby, okay? So that, so that we can go back to school and have good education and at least be recognized in the society. Kwame, I said I can't! I can't! Kwame, please. This is the only way I can tell you that I love you. The only way I can show you true love. By keeping this baby, please. I can't abort it. I know, I know, I know. I know, I know but I, I draw this pregnancy. Kwame, oh, it's okay, it's all right. See. I have a suggestion. You don't need to drop out of school. See, I will drop out of school and try to support you. You will continue your education up to university level. Do you know what you're saying? Do you, know, do you understand the consequences of what you're saying? You will drop out of school and and and, and try to support me. Oh no no, Kwame. this is ridiculous. Please believe me. See, I love you so much. I can do it. Hmm. I can make it, please. I will support you. All I want is a good life for you, for us. Please. Ajua, this is not easy. This, I, I'm confused. I don't... Don't worry. It should be my problem, not yours. Okay? I... It's okay. I love you so much. I'm, I'm sorry, Anne. I'm sorry, but I, I was just confused. That was why I took you to the it's hospital. It's okay. It's okay. You know, I was imagining how could you have done a thing like that? I want to ask you for assistance to please give me some money so that I can register in the hospital for antenatal care. Have you told your father? Mama, I, I don't want to ask him for money again because the last time I did, he nearly chopped off my head with a cutlass. So I, I don't want to ask him. Then where do I get the money from? Hmm? Mama, I know you've been doing some monthly contribution. Please, you can collect money from there and give me. I promise I'll pay you back. Soon, Mama, I'll pay you back. After you have received salary from that student father of your child to be. Huh? Is he working? Mama. Please. Mama, please. 
okay. I'll see what I can do. Thank you, Mama. <laughs> Mama, you know that's why I love you so much. Mm. I love you so much, Mama. Thank you. I'm so happy. You're welcome. Thank you very much. <laughs> Your Why? I'm not in the mood for any orange. Hmm? Is it about the pension arrears? Don't worry. The government has promised to pay you people, okay? Don't worry. Six months, they promised to pay us our pension allowance. But still, they've not paid. Look, the money left in my account is so small, I don't know what to do. Hmm? Don't worry. God is in control. What will touch their hearts, okay, so that they pay you? Mama, did you pay me? Papa, did you Look at her. Look at her. This is the way she wants to lead her life. Hawking ice water on the streets. Hey! Me, man, sir. I have seen 99. The thing that one hates is what he gets. Hey! Hmm. Hmm. Papa, she said she wants to sell ice water to keep her busy so that she wouldn't think much. She wants to forget about her problems. Please. Who gave her the money to sell the ice water? From the allowance she used to give her. She's been saving some, maybe. Oh, take one, take one. Ah. Are you okay? Is it long you've been waiting? Uh, yes. Oh, sorry, we went out. We, we, we just... Oh, sorry, I'm sorry for keeping you waiting. Okay, um, Mike. So how's business today? Uh, it was fine. Um, yes. All right, I, I'll excuse the two of you now. Okay. I'll be inside. Mm -hmm. Are you okay? Yes, I'm all right. Are you sure? Mm -hmm. I... That was my pleasure. It was okay. I, I brought... Sorry. I brought you this. <clears throat> oh, Ajua. Um, believe me, every, very soon everything will be alright, okay? Chobe, this is too much now. Oh, you please, please, don't even say it. Hmm? <laughs> okay. um, you know what? what? We we'll prepared some soup. Let's go in and eat. Oh, don't, no, 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 don't worry. I, I don't want to be home late, okay? Let me just start rushing home now. Yeah. Yes, it's okay. Alright. All right. Yeah. I love you. Don't worry. <laughs> Mike! Uh -huh. Yeah! See you later! When you're home. Oh boy! I'm back. Are you okay? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm just, I'm just trying to figure out why things are, are going like this. Keep depending on that poor girl. I can't. Hmm. Well, there's nothing you can do. Kwame, I've never seen a girl as nice as you have. She's so beautiful. She suggests nice things in your life. 
coming. She's got wisdom. No. No. That's why I have to do something fast. There's nothing much you can do now. Besides, the examination is just around the corner. Tell it, cheer up. Huh? Put yourself together. She said I should give it to you. Dearest, how are you doing? I was on my way to the clinic from the market when I saw your friend. Please, the money inside is for you. I'll send my to you as soon as possible. Stay blessed. Yours love. Adjoa Mensa. Oh no, no, no. This can't keep happening. This is not fair. I can't keep stretching that poor girl. It's no longer that girl gave me money now. She she sent me some money again. Oh no, this is not fair. I'm 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 stressing that girl too much. Oh God help me. Well, Sorry. let's face the reality. This is the biggest opportunity of your life. Charlie, cheer up, cheer up, and let's eat. I'm buying Sorry, sir. I, I heard Adria is not feeling too fine. That's why I came to see her. Thank you so much. But listen and listen good. I don't want you to come to this house anymore. Now leave. I'm sorry, sir. I just have to see Adria. Okay. Okay. Let me call Adria for you. I'm coming. <laughs> <laughs> Mike, there's something that you believe it. Kwabi told me about the baptism of water he went through your house. Oh. <laughs> oh. You need to see drama. Come on, see. I refuse to move. <laughs> ah, even when I saw fire coming out of the father's nostrils, I refuse to move. <laughs> I stood my ground and said for my baby, for my fine, for my fine girl, I wouldn't budge one bit. Meanwhile, inside me, I was dying, I was shivering, I was, I was just shaking. The man when you know, the father is a tough man. Today but afterwards, uh, my father regretted everything, you know. My mother really spoke sense into, into him. Okay. My mother has been of tremendous help ever since. I mean, what, what else can we expect from mothers? If, if our hearts were like our mothers, I'm sure the world would be a better place. <laughs> yeah, you're right. But you agree? I think you're right. Amor! <laughs> 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 I just submitted the university and transforms. That's good. Right. 
I'm still not comfortable. Why? This whole thing, I, the responsibility is not, it's not easy to support somebody in the university. I think it's too much for you to, to, to show that it's, it's too much. So what do you want to do? Well, I'm considering going to see my parents. Okay. And if, if they don't listen to you? Anyway, I pray God they listen to you. But if they don't, God will make a way. believe this my resort is beautiful. Oh, thank God for making me come out in flying colors. At least the efforts of our joy is not in vain. Oh, she'll be happy to hear this. Oh, thank God for this result. I joy the love of my life. <laughs> so I can't enter the university this year. After all the Sleepless nights of drinking too much coffee. Oh God. Am I really going to be right this exam? Oh God, I'm finished. <laughs> Mike! Mike! <laughs> Mike! Mike! Mike. <laughs> Mike, 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 I made it, Mike. Mike, what is it? Mike, Mike. I didn't make it. Oh Jesus, Jesus! I feel the accident. Oh Jesus! Hey, I'm happy for you though. Congratulations. So, uh, oh, jeez. Mike, it's okay. It's it's okay. Your parents will understand. It's okay. Cheer up. Besides, your white result was excellent. My parents will think I wasted their money. They rented this place for me so I could have all the time in the world to study. I mean, since the school is not in my town. Ma no, no, no. Oh, I'm Mike, is, Mike is okay, he's okay, cheer up. At least they should understand. Your past results have always been good. But Charlie, but I don't understand these university exam people. I was not even studying very hard for the exams. I was busy thinking of how to become a father and I passed the exams just like that. And look at you. You spent all the time studying and you didn't make it. This is serious. Ah, of a truth, now I know that saying that goes that the exam is not the best test of a man's ability. Don't worry, you'll make it next time, okay? Eh? Cheer up, it's okay, it's not the end of life. Mama, oh, hey, Mama, you won't believe this, Mama. I came back from the market and I saw this letter. It says Kwame has gained admission into the university. Mama, I'm so happy. I'm so happy, Mama. Oh, Mama, look at this. Mm. Congratulations. Mama, you're not happy for me. I should be happy with a man who has ruined my daughter's life and gained admission to the university to be somebody tomorrow. And my daughter, nobody. You want me to be happy with this, eh? Mama. Hmm. Don't worry, everything will be alright. 
After Kwame has finished his education, I will still go to school after we are married. Mama, everything will be all right. It is easier said than done. Look, I don't, I don't know how I'm going to cope. You know, it, it, it worries me every day when I think of it. It has never been my intention to, to leave you for once. Now that you're going back to school, do you have any choice? Mm, really? <laughs> I really don't. But what do I do? I I really miss you. I really miss you, Ajuan. Besides, I I want to be around when 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 you're giving birth to. Oh, to our come baby. On. <laughs> don't worry, my dear. The good Lord that would serve will take care of us. All I want you to do now is concentrate on your studies. Please. Mm. <laughs> I'm really going to miss you. I miss you too. And take care of this baby. Yes. I love you. I love you too. Always remember that. Okay. Thank you. Yes, come in. Ah, Ajwa. Oh, come oh, in. Good morning. Good morning. Are you ready for the market this early? No, not really. Okay, how does it? Yeah, thank you. I have an appointment with the doctor this morning. So as soon as I'm through with him, I'll come to the market. That's your early morning visit. I hope there is nothing wrong. Sewa, mm -hmm. please, I need help. I, I need some money to pay for my antenatal care. And where am I going to get that? You are a living witness when I paid for my goods. Please, I, I know you can help me, Sewa. There's no other person I can go to at this point. Please, help me, please. Like, how much do you need? 500,000 cities. I'll pay you back at the end of this Thursday uh, market day. Please. Please. Okay. I have somebody's money with me here. I will give it to you. But please, please try and pay me back on time. Please. I promise. Have I ever failed you before? I promise I'll pay you back soon. Trust me, please. Please. Okay. Yeah. Oh. Thank you very much. You're welcome. God bless you. Thank you. I'll see you later in the market. Okay. I'll be expecting you. All right. Okay. Thank you very You're much. Welcome. Let me see you all. Oh, okay. <laughs> Thank you.
I just got one, and a certain man told me what happened. And I got the things to go for you. You shouldn't be stressing yourself like this. Eh? You mean more to me than all those things. Take everything easy, okay? I can't afford to lose you. Eh? Oh, Jesus. Yeah, sure. What is this? Kwame Pongo! Kwame Pongo! Kwame! Kwame Pongo! Kwame! Kwame! Are you okay? Uh, I'm okay. Alright. So what's the problem? I'm just having memories, that's all. Memories? Memories and you, you didn't even hear I entered the room? What, what got you carried away like that? Tell me. Cynthia, for instance. Cynthia is a good girl. Pick on Cynthia, right? Mm -hmm. If you can't say anything, if you can't go forward, look, I'll do it myself. Man, I'll con her. Right? She'll lie low for you. Telling. Who's? 
You will never understand. Make me never. understand. Make me understand. Come. You will never understand. Tell me the problem. Tell me. Look, just speak on her and you'll be happy. I mean, even thinking about her, 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 her you know how she dresses her, the, the mini skits and all that, right? She she takes one step and see all her ties and <laughs> you know she's she's fair, you know. <laughs> and man, you you're blessed. You look at the the ties and you are blessed. Look how handsome you are. Down your nose to your lips. I mean, <laughs> I tell you, these babes will die for you. I don't know your problem. I don't know your problem, Kwame. To a bouncing baby boy. Jesus, you are good, oh. Your love endures forever. Eh? Me? A grandmother? I <laughs> mean, can I see my cousin? You can. I mean, 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 Everything is nice. Bouncy baby boy. Just like Wami. Did you see his face? Look at the forehead. Hey, thank God. Thank God. Well. As you can see, by the grace of God, Ajua has delivered a very beautiful Bouncy baby, baby boy. Good. and uh, as custom demands, uh, we have something small here. Oh. Madam, what will you take? <laughs> Fanta. Fanta, yeah? <laughs> All right, and uh, will you take it? Ajua. This is my daughter. This is my communicated with him? Uh, yes, I sent a message to him through the classmate. Oh, that is good. As the father of the child, he should be the first to know. Yes. <laughs> uh, Adwa, uh, go in there and then look after the baby, okay? Uh, we will serve ourselves. <laughs> you go and have a good night. Semester, I think, we will go for the yes. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> Ah, to assure you, Mr. Mensa, after his uh, university education, we shall come to ask for a hand in marriage. Yes, thank God. Oh, we will come. This is what we are waiting for. We will thank come. God. You know he's in school now. We will come. There is this girl who is pregnant for me in the village. And I just have this feeling that all is not well with her. I can't believe this. <laughs> you mean you have a wife who is pregnant in the village? <laughs> Pami. Papa Kwame. <laughs> yes. She is pregnant for me. And she's been so nice to me. 
I intend to marry her after graduation. What's wrong with you? Are you blind? A village girl in this millennium. No, what's wrong with you? Can't you see beautiful girls with vision on campus? Come to think of it, how old are you anyway? Huh? A handsome lot. Look, don't say this to anyone to hear, I'm telling you. Besides, excuse me. Kwame. Papa Kwame. I love Papa Kwame. Can you invite me to the occasion? Forgiving him, look, he's no longer the bad boy you know. He's a changed boy now. Changed boy ah. indeed. Nonsense. How are you, my son? I'm fine. I'm you are fine. fine. How is school? My school is okay. Ah. And you? I am <laughs> fine. <laughs> hey. Look, don't mind your father. Don't listen. Look, he's, you know his behavior. Eh? And you know what? He's been worried about you. No, hmm. I understand. Maybe he thinks I'll finally come back home. You see? <laughs> Have you heard the good news? Yes, I did. They sent a message to me in school. Do you know what? I want you to come with me to the mm -hmm. house so that we'll see them. Let me wear something nice. Let me change. Hey, but you know what? We have been to the house. Yes. And your son, he looks just like you. Oh. A carbon copy of you! Ah! <laughs> hey, son! Let me change. Let me change. Hey, 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 hey. Let me change. Oh, 
even looks exactly. Oh, don't say that because it looks like me. Look at the complexion. It's me. Oh, come on. Look at the baby. Look oh, at my stop. nose. Look, look at my nose. I know you would say that. Mm. So what name are we going to give the baby? My father called him Kwame. Kwame? Yes. Oh, that's nice. It's lovely. This is the most wonderful gift you've ever given to me. Oh, thank God. Thank you. You're behaving as if you're the mother. Oh, I'm here, so. <laughs> what are you doing at my van? Hey, hey, hey. Oh, God. Hold the baby tight. Don't drop my baby. Oh, oh, God. What is this? Come here. Oh, this is beautiful. You like it? I love it. Oh, it's just a little, it's a token, just a little thing for you. Oh, thank you. Hmm? Thank you very much. That's all right. Is it expensive? Oh, nothing can be too expensive for you and my little thing here. <laughs> oh, this is wonderful. Mm. Mm. I love you too. <laughs> um, how about your mother? Oh, she couldn't come. She went somewhere. Well, we're back coming, Betty. She will come tomorrow. Oh, all right. Look at her, baby. A great time for me. <laughs> Good night. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye bye. It's up to what you have. Oh please. no, Ajua, no, no, no. That is not what brought me to the village. I, I, I just came to see you and the baby. Oh, come on, you just gave birth. You need all the money. Look, keep the money and look after yourself and my son, okay? I have enough. At least the one you gave me the last time, I still have some. And I'm expecting a sneak loan. You understand? Yeah, what? Right. Take this money, keep it. When the loan comes, then you can pay me back, Adjua, okay? Adjua. See, I, okay, keep it for your upkeeping, please. What would I do without you? Hmm? I really love you. Mm, love you too. Oh. Honestly, I'm looking forward to the day we'll get married. I want you to be a good girl, okay? Please, then. I've always been a good girl, my love. I'm also looking forward to the day we we'll live together as husband and wife to be the happiest day. To see you make it through. Hello. How are you? How are you? Thank you. Is uh also in? Yeah, he's right in. Yes, come. Oh, Bosu. Oh, hey, Bosu. you, Bami. <laughs> <laughs> Boy, how are you doing? Hey, look, I called your office twice today and I was told you hadn't reached the office yet. What happened to you? Oh, yeah, I've not been to the office the whole day. Why did you try my mobile? Hey, look, I did and the computer kept saying, see that switch up or out of coverage area. That's true, that's true. I was low on battery, I forgot. I was low on battery. So, um, <clears throat> how are you? Hey, low bad. So nice sweet, man. Yeah. Yeah. Meet Halina. Hello. How are you? Hello. Don't don't tell me you don't recognize Helena. She was one of us at the university. Oh, yeah, that's true. I was trying to remember. She has a very familiar face. Yes. And look, she was the one who organized the party that was rated number one on campus. The strip tease. Have you forgotten? Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's true, that's true, that's true. Oh, great. You look prettier than before. Thank you. Oh. You're not looking great. too bad yourself, huh? Ah. Um, what do you do for a living? Oh, well, actually, I'm into computers. I supply all this. Mm. That's good. That's mm. good. So, um, 
And you? What do you do? Still looking for a job. Oh, no, no. You get one. You get one soon. Amen. <laughs> you get a job soon. <laughs> okay, oh. right. Let's drink to this great reunion. <laughs> it made so <clears throat> Let me go back to my school days. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, so. Oh, so. Hey. Okay. Let me help you with this. Okay. Right. Thanks. Oh, thank you. You're welcome. Thanks. Oh, cheers. Cheers. <laughs> <laughs> to to this um reunion and yeah. success, and success business long life <laughs> and everything <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's good. Mm. um from here um i'd like to show you my house oh <clears throat> it's a small place though mm -hmm. what oh okay yeah, yeah i have um i have little time so maybe Okay. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. Mm. Oh, 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 oh,
when your heart bleeds. It's my life, it's my choice, it's my heart. It's my heart. Just remembering our years of frustration and sorrows. It's all right. It's okay. Why don't you put all that behind you? Hmm? To put all that behind you. Just look at what God has done for us. All this through you, because of you. Hmm? Look at what God has done for me. It's wonderful. <clears throat> Just consider those years as lost years. They're gone, okay? Let's look forward. Mm -hmm. Okay. okay. Um, let's see that. Yeah. When are we finally getting married? 
this roll out. I love very soon. You know what? I just want to conclude a few things. So you just give me a few months. Are we going to see your parents officially? I saw that a few things. And besides that, I want to like bring Junior in, put him in a very good private school. And while he's in school, you have to go back to school too. All the years that you lost out, God is going to like restore them. I think you have to like go back to school, do a professional course. Oh, that would be wonderful. It's okay. It's all like a dream to me, you know. <laughs> well, man, I love you. I love you so much. I love you too. I love you too, my baby. I love you. I love you. I love you. I truly love you. You did all this. Of a truth in a strong way. Very strong. The support. Maybe we should go to bed now. Oh yeah. That my, my son could do this school, send me so much money. I'll go to the city myself and find out things. Hey, Adwa is a very good girl. Look, she brought all this money. Are you saying the money was brought through her? Through Adwa? Ah, she's been visiting him in the city. I'll go there myself. I have to go first. <laughs> Sweetheart, eat, eat, eat your food. You see, be, because of the money, I'm eating oh, full of Put it somewhere and eat. <laughs> okay. What, Mama? Okay. I'm all ears. Achua, Mama. What are the plans of this man called Kwame Torres you? Concerning what, Mama? Concerning coming to pay for the bride price and taking you to live with him. Mama, I have told you times without number what his plans are. It's just that he's trying to settle down properly first. That's all, Mama. He's got good job now. I, I, I have a feeling he won't marry you. My mind never deceives me, you know. Mama, I trust Kwame. He can't do a thing like that. He can't even hurt a fly. Okay, Mama, we have concluded Getting married very soon. Very soon he will come and see you people and everything will be all right, Mama. Believe me. Just believe me, Mama. I pray he does you. But my daughter, 
things are changing. I believe the best thing for you to do, return to school and have a future for yourself, my daughter. That is exactly what Kwame said, Mama. He said mm -hmm. after our wedding, I will go for a, a professional course. It's just the same thing. Hey, Mama. Mm -hmm. There she goes again. Kwame here, Kwame there, Kwame everywhere. You believe everything that he tells you, but coming to marry you too is a problem. Why? Have you ever fallen in love before? Your father paid for the bride price before sleeping with me. He paid for everything, oh, everything, oh, before sleeping with me. Be careful. I like you. You're my only child. That is why I'm saying all this. I don't want to hurt you. I understand. Welcome. This, this is serious. Look, you're looking wonderful. <laughs> you know I was at the village last week? Oh, really? How was mm. it? Well, not too bad. Oh, great. <laughs> um, who's that damsel? Come, come take a look at her. That's my fiancée. Your fiancée? Oh, yeah. Come say hello to her. So, what happened to the mother of your son? I mean, Ajua. Oh, Don't on. tell me you didn't marry her. Oh, come on. That's stale news. That's stale news. Come off it. How did you expect me to marry a Jua? An illiterate. An illiterate. She's not my class. Come, maybe you didn't take a good look at that woman. Come, come in. Come, take a look at that woman. She's beautiful. She's rich. She's got class. She has contact. She's loaded. She's, she's everything. That's my class. That's... Come off it. You are crazy, I mean, You are crazy. Oh. <laughs> After all the things that Ajua did for you, so? all the sacrifices that so? she made for you. So? You don't understand. Maybe I, let me explain. No, 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 no. There's no explanation for this. You can't explain this. I mean, how can you... Look, Kwame. If you disappointed Ajua, then you're doomed for life. Yeah, you come off it. Well, since you don't want me to explain, that's your problem. I have my life to live. We're just um, discussing some trivial issues. No, no. I don't believe you. Who is the man? Come on. Well, 
He was a very good friend until he did something very stupid to me. So I cut off from him. And now he's back asking for reconciliation. I told him I don't want to reconcile. He got angry, started calling me names. <laughs> so I walked out on him. That's all. Once he's come back for forgiveness, please forgive me. Okay, please. Please. No, no, no. I'm sorry. I don't want this friendship. That guy is a devil in human flesh. Honestly. <laughs> I don't want this friendship. Did we get any visitors? No visitors, sir. Okay. Those things are breakable. You take care of them. How is Baba and the people in the village? Everybody is fine, eh? They are all fine. Yes, thank you. <laughs> I haven't been here in a long while. This place has changed, Papa. Hey, pardon me. Oh, my son. Oh, sorry, madam. Master's mother is here. This is my mother. Mm -hmm. And uh, Mama, meet my sweetheart. Mama, you're welcome. Thank you. Okay, come. Come get Mama something to eat. Okay. Do you think she'll be comfortable with the food around here? Oh, come off it, Mama. My mother is not a bushwoman. Get her something to eat. Okay. <laughs> oh, so, Mama, how was how the trip? Hey, 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 Mami. What is going on here? What is going on here? What is it? Like how? Like what? Tell me what is going on. Tell me. Is this how you are going to pay the poor girl in the village? Is this how you are me? Mama, I expect you to understand. Understand what? Understand what? So it's because of this thing. That is why you have stopped coming to the village. Oh, you don't know what you are about to do. You don't know. Hey! Mama, I'm not missing anything. Honestly. Mommy. You need to take a good look at that woman. Look, look at her oh, properly. That, she has everything I want in a woman. She's educated. She's rich. She has contact. She... She has everything. She is beautiful. She is beautiful. She has everything. Hey, don't let me be angry. She has everything. Do you know what Agba would have been before you wrecked her life like this? Do you know? Do you know? Mama, mama, mama. Mama, mama. mama look at it for yourself. Ajoa, mama, honestly, Ajoa is not just it. Look at, just look at the world. Ajoa is not it. She doesn't have it. Okay. Imagine me standing in front of my colleagues, hmm. professionals, and introducing Adjua, an illiterate, as my wife. Hey, shut your mouth! Shut up! Just shut up! Have I been to school before? Have I been to school? I am asking you, have I been to school before? But your father married me. Your father married me. Have I been to school before? 
Don't let me hear that from you anymore. Shut your mouth about this thing. If, where is he going? Stand here. Where are you going? Where are you going? Are you walking out on me? Where are you going? Listen to me. Get that girl out of this house immediately now. Get her out. I can't take this. Jay, hey, hey. For your own information, our marriage is at hand. Hey, Kwame. Hey, Nuncho. I do Oh. What do people say about this family? This boy will kill me. Which of the rooms uh, should I take them to? Don't be stupid, Gojo. Don't you know where my mind is? Take them to the guest room. Hello, you're welcome. Sorry, madam. Well, I am not for the guest room. I have come to see Kwame. And uh, who are you, if I may ask? You're asking me who I am? Yes. I should rather ask you that. In that case, you're not needed in this house. Could you please take them out? Take me out? Do you know what you're saying? Who are you? How dare you tell him to take me out? Could you? What is I the said, meaning of that? Hey, what is going take on there? What, what is happening here? What's the meaning of all this? Daddy, daddy. Hey! Get off. Ajwa, what's your problem? You can't just come in and start making noise. Hold your peace. Why don't you just. Kwame. Uh, oh! What is the meaning of this? Oh, please hold your peace. You just relax and just hold your peace. Please. Eh? Darling, Kwame, what is going on in, in, in this house? It's all right. Who is this lady? Oh, come, come, come. Don't mind them. I just saw Come, come. Is it right? Right? Oh, please. I... Darling! Like you. God. Is it wrong to love someone oh, like you? God. I gave um, um, Adjoa, um, why don't you uh, just take this money and just go back to the village and uh, maybe you, when I come back, I'll uh, come in next time, I'll, I'll... Don't come near me. Don't even dare come near me, Kwame. Because if you do, I'll bite off your heads, your dirty heads. <laughs> Listen, I expect you to understand that things can just work between us. Can't you look at look at you? Just just look at you. Things can't work between us. You should understand. Get it into your head, okay? Kwame, look me into the eyes and tell me that things will work between us. <laughs> Kwame, look at me and tell me that things won't work between us. Oh, look, take your what? What's your problem? Oh, don't spoil my. Kwame, you, you. With the same mouth, Kwame, that you told me you love me, you're telling me that this won't work out, Kwame. Look at me. What's your. What, what is, what is, Just look at you, Kwame. What have I done to you? What is what wrong? Hey, 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 hey. What is wrong with you? Kwame, what have I done to you? What have I done to you, Kwame? What have I done? Listen. Hey, hey, What have I done Kwame. to you? Hey, look, take, take this. Kujo. What have I done? Kujo, Kwame, take this crazy people out of this Kwame. house. What's your problem? Oh please! Take Kujo us! Take these people out of my house! You come into my house to do stuff for things. What's your problem? Take them out of this place! 
I will go, woman. I will leave your house for you. It will never be well with you, woman. Madam, okay. Never. This is how you pay me back after all I suffered for Madam, you. It's okay now. After all I suffered to make you somebody, woman. Please, please, it's okay. Now. I will go. Yes, I know it. Huh? I know it will be like this. Okay, okay. I will leave you. Madam, 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 Watch it, come here. Come. Hey, leave me alone. I warned you. Oh, I, I warned no, you. No, 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 no. She's not worth it. Is this how you are going to pay this poor girl? Hey, Is come off it. Leave her, leave her. Let her go. Let her go. Oh, oh. this is just the beginning. Adwa. Hey, could you take, take, take that bag? Take, drop it in the get house. Anytime she wants to. Hey, let her go. I warned you. Why are you taking it? I say, take it out there. Don't put that in my house. Yes, sir. Take it out. Okay. Come into my house to harass me. Spoil my beautiful house. Listen! Daniel, what's the meaning of all this? Who was that woman? Oh, sweetheart, you, you, you. You can't believe Don't miss something, please. Is it not my mother? Can you just beat, beat that? It's rather amusing. They went home and arranged a widow for me to marry. Can you beat that? <laughs> My mother and her problems. Oh, Christ. This is serious. Very serious. <laughs> but, sweetheart, yeah. the little boy called you dad. How about that? It beats me. They must have planned and told the little boy to come and call me daddy. Daddy, do I look like a daddy? <laughs> You don't this mind all this, baby. Oh, no, 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 no. Don't mind all that. It's not real. <laughs> Do I look like daddy? I gave up my heart to see you make it through. I stood by you because I believe in you. It's my life. It's my choice. It's my heart It's my heart My heart My heart It's my heart
say to love someone like you I give my heart you broke my heart cause I'm wrong to fall in love with you I give You broke my heart Guess I'm wrong To fall in love with you I give my heart You broke my heart Guess I'm wrong To fall in love with you I gave my heart, you broke my heart, guess I'm wrong to fall in love with you. Young and green, we like to play around, enjoy. When your heart bleeds, when your heart bleeds, it's my life, it's my choice, it's my heart, it's my heart, my heart. my heart to see you make it through I stood by you cause I believe in you it's my life it's my choice it's my Hey, 
Hey, it seems something terrible has happened to that girl, eh? Not your papa. I don't know. Let me check up, eh? Those who got married today, the next day, the cold arms of death rather than widow. So in all things, just give thanks to God. Before you were born, God knows what you shall be in future. So in everything, just give thanks to God. And I believe God is going to restore everything that you've lost a hundred times. Pastor. Yes. I have lost everything. Everything that I have is gone, Pastor. You have I have it. lost hope in life. Listen. You haven't lost anything. Look at Job in the Bible. His children. He lost his children. Everything that Job had. He lost it. But he has faith in the Lord. And God's mind who surpasses all understanding restore everything for you. You are a child of God. What you need now is a little faith. Just have faith in the Lord and everything will be well with you. It's okay. Thank you. I just need a little bit pray for you. Father, I bring this lady into your mighty hands. Father, you know the problem she is facing right now. Father, your word said in Matthew chapter 7, 7, ask you shall be given. Seek and you shall find. Knock it shall be opened unto you. Father, I therefore bring this lady into your mighty hands. Your word said we should carry all our burdens and you shall give us rest. Father, we need rest. Father, this lady needs rest. Father, restore everything for her. Father, I take the Holy Spirit to bring all principalities in her. And Father, restore her. Give her the glory. She in the name of Jesus Christ, I pray. Amen. 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 Thank you, Pastor. Thank you very much. Thank you. I have to go. Thank Try you. to come to Sunday's just I will. temperature is rising. I just need some tablets, please. It will cost you 45,000. Okay, but I, I have 10,000 students here. I'll pay you 35 when I come back from market tomorrow, please. What? Do you think this is a charity home? Yeah, I don't sell my drugs on credit. Besides, I don't know you. My, my name is Adria Mensa. I live just across the road. Please, I'll return this money tomorrow. I promise I'll return Am this I money. Am I supposed to know everybody around this area? Please, ma'am. I, I know you can help me. My son is dying, please. Please, ma'am, just help me, please. Are you sure you bring the money? Yes, I'll bring the money tomorrow, I promise. Please. Okay. I'll give you the drugs. I'll make sure you bring the money. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. God bless you. I'm 
child? My child is good. As for life, it's been very tough. Very tough. So, it's okay. So, where do you, what do you do now? I work with Ghana High Commission in Nigeria. He just came back for vacation. Oh, great. You're a big girl now, you know. It's by grace. Thank God for your life. Is that your car? Yes, that's my car. Great, you know, it has always been my dream to be a graduate like you, work and at least have my own car. And it's okay. It's not too late. You can still go back to school and achieve your aim. It'll be all right, okay. Okay. Anyway, let me see. Just have this for the child, okay? okay. Everything's going to be okay. Just Thank you very patience. much. I'm Thank going to you. purchase one or two things here, and I'll see you when I'm on my way back home, right? Oh, all right. Okay. Thank you very much. You take care. Bye bye. Thank you. Look at all my classmates. They are all now graduates. And here I am. Oh, life. Anyway, what will I do? Where's the bowl of kinky I was supposed to eat this morning? Daddy, I'm sorry. Junior was hungry this morning, so I fed him with it. Uh -uh. Are you not ashamed of yourself? Eh? Look at this miserable condition you put yourself in. Look, go and check your meals. Some of them are doctors, some of them are engineers, and you are here disturbing my life. Look, you better go and live with that stupid man you had a child with. Him. Uh -huh. Is it wrong to love someone like you? Is it wrong to love someone like you? I gave my heart, you broke my heart. Yes, I'm wrong to fall in love with you. He has been sick, oh. His temperature is very high. I'm taking him to the clinic, please. Okay, I'll join you. Okay. Please, Mama, wait for me. Don't keep long, go. Is that right? Is okay? To love someone like you. I gave my heart. You broke my heart. Yes, I'm wrong. To love someone like you. Is it wrong to love someone like you? Wow. 
welcome, Mr. Watt. Oh, thank you very much, Doctor. Uh, so, uh, is there any hope for us? Mr. Watt. Yeah. In as much as it is against the ethics of our profession to reveal patients' tests to any other person, I think I must tell you the truth. Has your wife ever told you about her health? Uh, could you be precise, please? One of your wife's fallopian tubes has been removed. Jesus. And the second one is not strong enough to fertilize an egg. No. No. Let's, doctor, are you saying my wife has only one fallopian tube? Yes. Jesus. And it, it will take quite some time to repair it. Oh, Jesus. Give her three more years. What do you mean? Three years? Why? Why? No way. I don't have all the patience. Jesus. Besides, she's supposed to have told me at least. Listen, I can't wait for her to give me a miracle baby. Excuse me. Mr. Watt. No. Listen. lifestyle during your school days and you didn't tell me? Jesus, you expect me to wait for a miracle baby from you, right? Jesus, darling, where did you get this information from? It's not true. Don't! Darling me! Don't! Listen, for your own information, I am going to the village right away to get my son and bring him into this house. Oh. Darling, please, darling. Tell me the truth concerning that woman and the child. How did he get me about your womb? 
The doctor must have told him. After giving him all that money to keep his mouth shut. Can you imagine? What are you going to do? I don't know. Seriously, I don't know. But one thing I know for sure, I am not going to sit around to let a village slot come and destroy everything I've told for. That, it won't happen. It, it will not happen. Reason why you are putting yourself about this village here? I'm sure you are the Mrs. Auntie. Please don't get yourself worried, okay? And now, your hair. Next time when you come, I will change it. It's kept too much long on your hair. Yes, madam. <laughs> the pleasure is all mine. Now, I have to leave now. Yes. Let me see you all. <laughs> Good afternoon. How are you, Fine, my daughter? You, oh, why? Did you meet anyone at home? No, sir. I've been knocking, but there was no response, so I'm sure there's nobody in there. Oh, where could all of them have gone to? I'm really surprised. Okay, sir, so I'll go and come back later okay. to check. All right, then. Have a nice day. Thank you. What do you want me to do? Hmm? You are asking me what do I want you to do? This is our daughter. Ever since the day God gave me this girl, I've not had one day's rest. Huh? Adwa, mommy, please allow me to enjoy my food in peace. Or you, you take it away. No, you can't take the food away. But anyway, have you seen her this morning? Uh, maybe she's gone to the city to see Kwame. Kwame? Are you sure? Look, go and check in a bedroom to find out she's there. I'm coming right now. Are you sleeping? Wake up. Forgive me, Mama. Oh, Mama. I wish I could stay. Oh. But please, take heart. May God protect and give you heart to get this. Station to this, my daughter. 
<laughs> you didn't listen, oh. Bring her go home, you didn't listen. Bring this girl home, you didn't listen, darling. She's dead. No, the poor girl is gone. Now the poor girl is gone, oh. <laughs> Who oh, believe my story? Oh, what crime did I commit? Oh God! It's my heart, my heart, my heart. I give it all for you. Yeah, right. Yes, I just said this. Hi! Polly! Also, also, my house is on fire. My house is tearing up. Calm down, calm down. Hey, you're not, you're not a small boy anymore. Make call that big boy shit. Look, I went to the doctor and he told me why my wife cannot give me a child. What do you mean? He told me my wife has no womb. It's just like buying a car without an engine. <laughs> well, 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 well. I'm not surprised. What? <laughs> you know what? What? This girl was the baddest girl on campus. So you knew all that? And you still recommended her? Hey, hey, hey. To me? Listen, I did not recommend her for marriage. I just gave her to you for something. And before I could say Jack Robinson, man, you married her. Don't, don't, don't. Please. I'm just, I'm going to the village to get my son and bring him into their house. I'll just yeah. get my, just the village, the village here. Right, right, right. Bobby. Bobby.
I'm 